Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, I've got two boxes here that I'm going to open. I uh, just thought I'd make a video on it because they're kind of related to the channel a little bit. At least this one is. This one was just kind of, I bought it because I kind of wanted a new one. And uh, this should be, obviously we're about to find out, uh, but this should be a keyboard. Uh, so we're going to open it up. I will try to make this as aesthetically pleasing as possible. Uh, not really. I'm just going to open it. Stab myself in the leg a little bit there with the screwdriver, but you know what? That's all right. It's gonna be just a quick video. Just uh, you know, why not? You know what? Some of you guys like these kind of videos. I don't know why, but uh, you do. So I got a new white box. Uh, my old white box is getting kind of bad. Uh, just kidding, obviously. This is a keyboard. Did a keyboard. We got some paper stuff. I'll never read. Ooh, we got some like. Oh, that is neat. It came with a red keycap. That's kind of neat. I, I'm obviously not that many. It looks like, yeah, it's just like the Air, Aerios, A, W, S, and D. Um, just stuff like that. That's kind of neat. But here we are. This is, this is the keyboard. That's it. It is a mechanical keyboard. It has Cherry MX Blue switches, which is what I have in my current keyboard. Um, but the reason I got a new keyboard, uh, as opposed, or besides the fact that I just wanted one, is that um, my keys on this stick all the time, so it's constantly putting in a bunch of extra uh, letters, which is really frustrating, um, and it gets really annoying. So I got this one. It is Gans Gans uh, G GK87. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool. You can hear it. There's some good ASMR for you. Yeah, you like that, don't you? But uh, yeah, so that's cool. Um, I'll kind of show you the difference as to what it looks like with mine. Um, I have a full-size keyboard uh, right now, whereas this one is a small or an 87 key keyboard. So there's actually less keys. So as you can see, there's there's no number pad over here, uh, which I never really use. Um, or at least I don't think I use. I feel like now that I don't have it, I feel like I'm just gonna be like, oh crap, I actually use those all the time, which would be kind of annoying, but uh, I don't think I really do. So I'll plug it in. Um, I'll turn my computer on. I'll show you what my current keyboard looks like right now. And then I'll show you what this one looks like. And then we will open up the second package. All right. So this is basically what my current keyboard is right now. It's some, uh, what does that say? Magic, what does it say? Magic Eagle? Is that what that says? Yeah, Magic Eagle. It's the Havit Gaming series. I don't know, it's all right. It's It's got lights and stuff, it's cool. It's RGB apparently, although you can tell it's just got a couple different colors. That's it, they don't change. Like this row is only blue, only purple, only green, only blue, only yellow, and only red, uh, which is kind of annoying. Um, there are like, some different things you can do to make it a little bit brighter turn it off um, what else can you do you can do uh, if you do function I don't know if I can reach that far now if you do function escape it does do a couple things um, like it just lights up the WASD and just these guys right here um, but that's about it and it has a breathing effect that's really it um, so I'll go ahead and I will plug in the new one and you guys can see how that one looks. It should be a lot brighter and it's kind of got a cool thing on it and I'll show you right now. Alrighty, so this is the new keyboard. As you can see, it is, uh, it's pretty cool and it's a lot smaller. Like, oh my God, it's so bright. Like literally everything looks so dark around it. But uh, yeah, it's it's pretty cool. I'm pretty stoked on it, I'm not gonna lie. It looks so legit, like look at this, damn. That looks awesome, that bar. I'm not really sure what we can do to it, but I know if it's the same as mine, page up. Oh, okay, that changes the colors. Oh, okay, so it's just kind of like different greens. I like the blue, the blue looks dope. That is really sick. Oh, and, and one, one second, one second. We can grab this guy, turn this on, make this blue, ooh. Yeah, I like that. That is sick. But yeah, this is pretty cool. It's uh, I don't know. It's really, it feels a lot better than my old keyboard. Um, I don't know. It just looks, it looks awesome. Like, damn, those colors look sick. Uh, or sorry, this one. I kind of wanted to just do all different colors. Oh, that's cool. It's like a white. Yeah, that one's sick. And then, I'm not sure what, how you do. Let me see if I can set this up in a way 
where I can use both hands. Okay, learning experience here, ladies and gentlemen. All right, we got both hands. We're hands free right now. So I'm pretty sure we do function. So now it's just individual keys light up as we press them. Just kind of cool. Sorry for the shit angle. And then this one is, it does like a cross. What is this one? Oh, and that's like a ripple. Look at that. That's like a rip. There's a freaking ripple one. That's pretty cool. And I'm pretty sure you can speed it up if you do like this. There's some way to f speed it up. I haven't really looked at it much, but uh, yeah, that's pretty awesome. That's sick. I think for the most part, I would only ever use it on just like that. Um, and you can change this as well. I'm not really sure how to do it, but you can have it so it's like a snake, almost like a snake that looks like it's going along. But yeah, that is awesome. I'm stoked. Um, new keyboard is awesome. And I'll put the other one beside it just to kind of show you like a size comparison anyways, just so you can see how much smaller it is because it is a lot smaller. Yeah, like you can see this one ends like that whole, basically just the number pad for the most part. But yeah, it's quite a bit smaller. Yeah, the keyboard is sick. Uh, I'm stoked on it. Uh, so now we're gonna open up the second box and take a look and see what that is. All right, it should be good now. Um, we're gonna open up this second box. Um, I'm fairly excited for this one. It should make things a lot cooler for stuff. I don't really wanna give it away. Um, open this guy up. Hopefully I'm opening it up the right way. I doubt I am, no. Let's open it up this way. Hopefully my address isn't on here. That would be embarrassing. I don't think it is. No, it's not. Open this guy up. All right, we have got a lens. It's a it's a wide angle. Uh, I wanted to, to get a new one to try it out and, uh, and see how it is. Uh, hopefully there's a little bit of a difference. I'm not sure how great it will be for video just cause it is it doesn't have like autofocus, it is manual. Um, so it may be more or less for photos. Uh, regardless, I'm still really excited. Um, I'll open it up and I'll show you guys and then we'll try it out. I don't know how well it'll work for video, especially since I can't really see if I'm in focus or not. Nice little baggie there. Oh, that's, that's nice, I guess. Uh, I don't know if I'll ever use it. Maybe I will. Very cool. Get the lens, they got it in this nice little plastic bag. Oh, Jesus. Damn, that is awesome. It's a uh, 12 mil, um, 12 to what? I think that's it. I think it's legit just a 12 mil. Yeah, that's all it is. It's just a 12 millimeter uh, wide angle. Uh, I mean, it's not really cool for you guys to just look at, so I might as well just put it on the camera. So I will go ahead and switch to it right now, um, and you can see the difference. And yeah, I guess we'll do a we'll do a snap. Are you ready? So, I mean, hopefully we're in focus. Hopefully everything looks okay. I don't know. I could be completely out of focus. Um, but yeah, this was a video of me unboxing stuff. Hopefully the lens looks all right. Hopefully I'm in focus. I'm in focus somewhere along here, somewhere along the lines. I have been in focus. So yeah, the neat new keyboard. Ooh, this bad boy is awesome. Like those lights just look incredible, especially along the side. It's, it's fairly like, you can't see like the LEDs. Um, like it's very smooth and it looks really good and I'm stoked on it. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, probably didn't because it was pretty lame. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Peace.